Hi, this is Vijay. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to add the well-known Northwind sample database to your SQL Server Management Studio. So let's get started. First, what you have to do is download the database from my website, in which I will I will have it in the description. All the all the credit goes to the website for making the file available. And now I'll show you how it, um, how the file looks. So the file will be like this, northwind.zip. You have to extract it to a specific folder. So click extract to, and here go to C drive, and you will see program files and program files x86. In my PC, it's in program files, but in some PC, it might be in program files x86. It depends on the on PC. So I'll go to program files and here I will scroll down you sh you will see Microsoft SQL Server expand that and here you will see several folders I will go to MS SQL 11 dot VJ underscore SQL so this is where I usually save my files and so I will expand this And if I expand it, there will be a folder called MSSQL. You should expand that again. Usually, this is where you should save uh, all your files. And here, click Data and hit OK. So that's it. Now you have saved it. So step one is over. Now, step two, how to bring the database to your SQL server. So here, what you have to do is, you have to click your database, databases, right click it, click attach, and this screen pops up, attach databases, hit add, and if you see, you should go to the same folder again, which is uh, your C my, uh, program files, Microsoft SQL Server, expand that, and here, you should see your name here, msql11.yourname underscore sql. Expand that again, and you should see this folder, msql. Expand that, and expand data, and you should see northwind.mdf. Click that, and click OK. So now, you have got your data here, and there is a log. For now, you don't need the log because the log will be created automatically so click the log and click remove so again you have deleted your log click this .mdf file and ok and it's just executing so your Northwind database has been successfully added to your SQL Server Management Studio so how to check if it has been added let's see so you're, you have to Refresh your database in which I will click F5. It has been refreshed. I'll go to if you if I see here, I see the Northwind database has been added. And if I expand this, and if I go to tables, I can see all the tables in that database. And if I want to check if I did all the steps like like correctly, I will click new query and then I will I will um, type in select start from um, any table like any table you want let's say customers 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 and the problem there is an error because we have to be in the Northwind database in order to extract this table so Northwind And now if I select this, execute, query executed successfully and you should see your table. So you did all the steps correctly. If you, if, if you're, if you miss any of these steps, you wouldn't even see your database here. And uh, you can't even execute this query. You will see errors. First, um, first of all, you wouldn't even see your database um, here. So. All you have to do is just extract the file to your MSSQL folder and then go to database, right click it, attach, 
and click add and go to the same folder find the northwind.mdf file hit ok delete the log file and click ok refresh your database to check if it is there and to make a final check insert your sql query by putting select star from any table from northwind database so this is how you insert Northwind database to your SQL Server Management Studio and thank you for watching.